Everyone is doing the most for the Australian bushfire and I am loving it. In light of the situation, I wanted to share this quick story because again, everyone's doing the most and helping out and I think it's great. Um, this is uh, actually pretty funny, but at the same time, you know, good for her for trying to help out uh, on what's going on there. She is a 21 year old model. Her name is Kaylin Ward. She is um, doing the most right now with um, the donation. She actually tweeted out to her fans um, telling them that she will be sending them um, a new photo of her if they send her a confirmation through her DM that they donated to the Australia bushfire. And so far it seems like she raised about a half of a million dollar, $500,000 so far on um, the, this donation. So, you know, good for her. You know, that's her occupation already. She's already doing news, so it's nothing that she is ashamed of. And um, I think that it's pretty incredible that she is willing to, to give that up and help out what's going on out there. But in all seriousness, today I wanted to touch uh, base on just one topic that came to light the other day that really um, it got my brain going into overdrive. I'm very conflicted and I don't understand why people do this. So Kim has been called out by one of her alleged followers. She tweeted saying, climate change is real, a heart broken emoji and earth emoji on about what's going on in Australia. One of her alleged fan actually retweeted back and says, nothing gets me more heated to see the Kardashian slash Jenner talk about climate change wildfires and not donate a penny. To which Kim respond, nothing gets me more heated than to see people think they know what we donated and to think we have to publicize everything. Again, this has been weighing on my mind for quite some time and the reason why this topic kind of got to me is because I'm very passionate about this topic. You know, I consider myself to be an avid giver, um, someone who donates and someone who loves to help other however that they can. I rarely talk about my experiences and I rarely really share any of my good deeds with anybody because you know, I believe in three things. Number one, it's not relevant. It doesn't matter. Number two, nobody cares about what or how much you're donating because, you know, the moment that you start to publicize or talk about your donation, it will make your, your good deeds or your generosity become obsolete. Number three, I truly believe there is a difference between being genuine and raising awareness about a certain tragedy or crisis versus you know talking about your involvement and your donation for an organization it's just very tacky you can raise awareness you know if you have a big platform and you can encourage your followers or your fans to to the people that trust you to do the right thing and that's okay now in kim's case she did fire back and she has the right to do so and you know for the first time ever i completely agree with her in this situation you know, I don't think it's anybody's business or um, responsibility to know about what other people are doing with their money. There's a lot of debate going on. People saying that, you know, she has a right to not say how much she donated or whether or not she donated. And then there's other people that are saying, well, you know, she's always in the, the public eye. So why isn't she publicizing this type of thing? She has the right to, you know, do whatever she wants with her money. It's her money. You know, even if she is a celebrity, even if she publicized everything in her life, you know, I think the most important thing is that as long as she is raising awareness and telling her fans um, on how they could help the situation, I think that's all that matters. She does not need to post how much she donated to uh, to the bushfire. I think very highly of people who have um, started an organization, a nonprofit to, to help other people, to help the world, and not talk about it or not publicize about it at all. You know, people like Jay Z, Beyonce, Bill Gates, you know, Mark Zuckerberg, all those people with millions and millions of dollars that are, are doing good and doing the most for the world, but they you don't hear a peep from them. I think that Obama highlighted this topic best in one of his speech. One danger I see among young people, particularly on college camps, is Malia and I talk about this. Yara goes to school with my daughter. Um, 
but I do get a sense sometimes now among certain young people, and this is accelerated by social media, there is this sense sometimes of the way of me making change is to be as judgmental as possible about other people. And that's enough. Like if I tweet or hashtag about how you didn't do something right or used the word wrong verb or then I can sit back and feel pretty good about myself because man, you see how woke I was? I called you out. <laughs> I'm gonna get on TV, <laughs> watch my show, watch Grownish. <laughs> um, you know, that's not that's not activism. That that's not bringing about change. You know, if if if, if all you're doing is casting stones, uh, you know, you're, you're probably not gonna get that far. Look, the point of this video is not about how much you should donate or if you should publicize it or not. It's about raising awareness and helping out other people however you can. We're all still standing in this tragedy and that feels more like a, a movie. The point is I don't want to be on Mars trying to plant potatoes with Matt Damon with our own shit. This is a real tragedy that can't be ignored and I think that we all need to step in and do our part and help out however we can. The harsh reality is that knowing that one day this might not be here anymore. I want to imagine that my children's children's, my nephew's children's children, and even yours children's children will be able to enjoy this planet for many, 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 many more decades. And that we continue to call this planet home. I've gathered all the links in the organization that you can donate to. Please click read about it and um, please help out and donate however you can.